Welcome to another edition of your Morning Cup Report. We start today with our delicious lunch menu. Today is we have baked potato and toppings. Yum. But if you don't like that, you can always choose from cheeseburgers, chicken sandwiches, sub sandwiches, and yogurt. We will also have tater tots and fish sandwich. Now we go to today's birthdays. We only have one birthday. team worked really hard to celebrate a commercial for everyone how Salt Team works. Here it is. You gotta be careful. No. You gotta be careful. No. <laughs> what, what does that note say? Stuff. Stop. Jackson, that's an automatic step four. But what about step one? You've already chosen step one three times this week. This time it's an automatic step four. Come in sooner, son, but I had a doctor's appointment today, so I will meet with your teacher tomorrow morning. Okay. So why did you choose step four? I didn't choose step four. Then why did you call me and say you're on a step four? Because the teacher didn't allow me to go to step one first. I'm confused. I thought it went step one, then step two, then step three before step four. I'm confused too. Is there someone you could so talk to sort this out? Oh, I know. I can bring my concern to the SALT team. SALT team? What is that? They're the Student Advocates and Liaison Team. SALT for short. <laughs> oh, does Park have a pepper team too? Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Jackson, I'm glad you brought this to me. I'll bring it to the Salt Talks on Thursday. Bye. Uh, my friend came to me and wondered why he chose step four without choosing any other steps first. What happened? According to Jackson, he was talking all right, but so were others, but he was only the one accountable. The teacher said he was getting an automatic step four because it was his third step one that week. He thought to, he thought to get an automatic step four, there had to be a verbal warning first. Well, that's true. And I would have to know um, the teacher's side of the situation. But um, usually what happens is uh, if a student is choosing step one too frequently, like over and over again, then it uh, it doesn't seem to be doing any good, and the student is going to step one and then coming back and going to step one again. So then, at, at, in those situations, the teacher can make a verbal contract, and that contract can include going to an automatic step four. Okay, but we would have to, you know, Mr. Gregory will have to look into that, and he'll talk with that teacher, and we'll find out. Dear Mr. Gregory. Today, during the SALT talks, it came to my attention that there's a concern from one of the students about an automatic step four. Ooh. SALT committee? Hmm. Probably gonna need to talk about that. Welcome to my class, Mr. Gregory. 
Yes, can I help you? Yeah, Miss Martinez, can we talk just for a minute? Yeah, what's up? Um, just had some concerns over a, a make your day issue that was brought to me with the SALT committee. And so I was hoping we could talk about that for a minute. <laughs> next month at Kenwa Kai. Come learn new skills from high school players. Get ready for the upcoming volleyball season. All ages and grades are available. Are welcome. See Mr. Gary at lunch for details. Here's who has signed up to do the cub report. Make sure and report to the office at 7 15 a.m. Don't forget to turn in your show stories, pictures, or poems to your learned adult teacher to be published in the Paw Prince Literary Magazine. Their next edition is coming up soon. Remember, all of our videos are on YouTube. Just, par just type in Park Middle School Kenwick. That's it for today, Cubs. Have a great, great day. Bye. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.